Mother's Day is around the corner, and joining us now is lifestyle expert Lena Almeida, who's here to tell you about a one-stop shop to find exceptional gifts for dear mom. Welcome, Lena. Well, it's great to be back. So I have to ask you, you're both moms. What yeah. was, can you think back to the best Mother's Day gift you ever received? It doesn't have to be specific, but just, you know, was it time? Was it time spent with your kids? Time spent alone? A perfumes? It was the one that I still had. Okay. It was a handmade, like a, a little basket that they put stuff together. But I always used to say, how come every time you go to the bathroom, uh, you know, there's a knock on the door. It's like they or they would slide notes yeah. under the door. I'm like, I just want some peace. So they gave me a bath in peace basket. They made a little, uh, you know, door that says do not disturb, mom's in mm-hmm. the bath, all this kind of stuff with and filled it with um, bath crystals and stuff. So that actually made it at school as part of a oh, as lovely. part of a project. I still have the actual thing that hangs over the door that says yeah. stay away is, is a foot. It's in the shape of a foot, like you're having a pedicure. So I still use that. Now I'm keeping my husband out. <laughs> no, not, not my kids. That was uh, that was the one I remembered first. What yeah. about you? Well, m- my children have always been extremely thoughtful. I think the one that comes to mind is the last one, which was a ticket to London oh. to see my great nieces who were like just born and not even a year old. So we're, we're all about family. So they oh, thought it would be good. Wonderful. They thought if they bought the ticket, they would make me go. Yeah. Because <laughs> <laughs> I always find a reason that I'm too busy to do whatever. But so. as moms, we tend to do yes. that. We tend to put other yeah. people before us, which is why we have a day yeah. dedicated yeah. to us. And you know I'm always looking for the best gifting ideas yes, and, and what's, absolutely. what's new and exciting. And, so and you usually find them. Thank you. I try my best. So this year, from May 6th to 12th, you can visit Scarborough Town Center for the Mother's Day Flower Market. It is located at Center Court, and I just already know it's going to be drop-dead beautiful. It is featuring Parisian-inspired florals, and it's actually going to be filled with hand-picked selections of fresh flowers ranging from peonies to garden roses. So just a beautiful floral wonderland, and it's right in Center Court. And of course, they're going to have vendors. So whenever mm-hmm. Scarborough Town Center has a market, they always bring in some of their best vendors. I can tell you what some of the confirmed vendors are. And the first is Blossom Moments. Blossom Moments has just jaw-droppingly beautiful um, bouquets and flower arrangements. So if you prefer to go the traditional route and get your mom flowers for Mother's Day. Blossom Moments will be there. Me, I'm more of a chocolate. I was going to say there's got to be <laughs> chocolate on Lena's I list know. somewhere. Yes. <laughs> so Chocolata will be there and they actually specialize in Brigadeiros. And in what? Brigadeiros. What's so a Brigadero? Brigadeiros is a Brazilian candy. Ah. In fact, my girlfriend who's Brazilian said if you're Brazilian and can't make a Brigadeiro, you are not Brazilian. <laughs> so, wow. <laughs> okay. It's very, very um, in tune with the Brazilian culture. And basically, it's somewhere between a fudgy chocolate truffle and a Tootsie Roll. So they hand roll them, usually roll them in sprinkles, or it could be anything now from coconut to, you know, little chocolate sprinkles. But She should like a... not be allowed in here <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, well, I we're know. We're going to have to go to the market together then from okay. May 6th All to 12th. Right. Because I'm giving everyone a sneak peek on what to expect okay. this year. And then they also have the Macaron Boutique, and I know that... Everyone loves macarons. I think it's just such a luxury, especially when gift giving, because we know the work that goes into making a beautiful macaron. It's just the care and attention. Mm -hmm. And they're just so beautiful to gift. So the Macaron Boutique will be there as well. And Lip Candy Lipstick. So Lip Candy Lipstick is actually handcrafted natural lipsticks that are made with ingredients you can actually pronounce. (laughs) And I did look them up on their website, and yes, I could pronounce (laughs) all of the natural ingredients. And there's something to be said, I think, for a vendor that sticks to what one item and just perfects it. So I'm really excited to see the I can't actually. I've never even really thought about what makes lipstick? Is it like one main ingredient in some color? We don't, oh. you, we, we don't, we don't want to know. know. <laughs> <laughs> but that's why you do want to look you, at the ingredients. Yeah, okay. Exactly. For lip this candy one lipstick. You will know. Yeah. That's right. 
And Scarborough Town Center also has a promo only available during the flower market this year. So again, that's from May 6th to 12th. And that is for every $200 Scarborough Town Center gift card that you purchase, you'll receive 5% back as a gift card to you. So treat mom, treat yourself. And I think that if we're talking about the gift card idea and the flower market, why not combine the two? So purchase a gift card before Mother's Day, but then maybe take mom down on Mother's Day weekend and go with her when she spends it. I think half the fun of um, Mother's Day is sometimes moms want to be Surprise. have some me yeah. time, but then sometimes they really do want to spend it with mm-hmm. <laughs> the, their reason <laughs> for being. Mm-hmm. So take mom down to Scarborough Town Center and visit the flower market and maybe pick out some goodies with her. So Lena, is there anywhere anybody can go to check it check it out before they actually physically get there? Absolutely. So ScarboroughTownCenter.com, mm-hmm. um, their website will be having updates right up until the flower market to let you know who the vendors are and what you can expect. So super exciting for Mother's Day. And I just, I've been to Scarborough Town Center markets in the past. The holiday market was beautiful. Mm-hmm. There's always an Instagram mo- moment. Did you sit on the Iron Throne? I did. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. I knew. I knew it. <laughs> so yeah, they they're famous for their Instagram moments. You bet. So we we took in the Easter, um, the Iron Throne, and the holiday market was of course the swing. So I can't wait to see what they have for Mother's Day. And that's another reason to go down with mom and maybe get a mom daughter or mom son or mom family photo. So what did your what did we didn't ask you? What was your favorite gift from your boys? My favorite gift from my boys was a handmade card because my boys are they'll be 9 and 11. So they don't have purchasing power just yet. So everything is handmade. And my 9-year-old wrote on the card, you know, dear mommy, we love you. And he wrote he actually wrote you're doing your best. <laughs> <laughs> Positive reinforcement. There you go. You're doing your best. <laughs> Thank you, Lena. That is precious. Uh, all right. Uh, we'll talk to you soon. <laughs> you bet. <laughs>